In this video, I'm going to show you how you can upload a PDF file to Google Drive and then share it via a link. So this is an example PDF. I'll upload it to Google Drive and I'll show you how you do it. So first you need to head over to Google Drive. Now there are a couple of ways you can do that. If you open Google Chrome, you can go to the Google Apps in the top right. Then you can go ahead and find Drive. For me though, I just like to search for Google Drive. So go ahead and just type that into Google, click on sign in. It will then, as long as you're signed into Google, it will then sign you in. And here you can go ahead and upload your PDF file. Now, if you've got more than one file, you can create a folder first. So you can go new and create a folder. For me though, I'm just going to upload one PDF file. So I'm gonna go new, file upload, and from here we can find the file. For me, I've made a separate folder with that file in it. So here is the file. We can find it on the computer. We can then click open and it will then upload that PDF file. Now what I would do is go to my drive and here you should see your file. If you go ahead and click last modified by me and you should be able to find it. If for some reason you can't find it, refresh or go to recent, here is the document. Now what we wanna do we can just first double click on it just to make sure the PDF has loaded and uploaded all right. In this case it has. So now let's right click on the PDF. We'll then go to share, click on share again. And if you want to share this via a link, you can do by copying the link. But with it on restricted, every time someone tries to view that after clicking on the link, it's going to send you an email. You're going to have to approve them. So if you don't want to be approving people, just change it to anyone with the link. And now this way, anyone with the link will be able to view the PDF. So you can then copy this link. You can also change it so people can either comment or edit it as well. But for the video, we're just going to keep it on viewer. We'll copy the link. You can now give this link to anyone and they'll be able to view the PDF. They'll also be able to download it. And that is how you do it.